Good afternoon everybody and welcome to the Israel Brief brought to you by Lay of the Land. I'm your host Jolene Marks for a very special Yom Hazikaron or Memorial Day Israel Brief. Uh, the words here is call we will remember and today the entire state of Israel comes together, bows our head and mourns for the over 23,000 men and women we have lost who have fallen in service to the country as soldiers, as police, in the security forces, as well as the 3,150 victims of terror. Sirens rang out at 8 o'clock last night, signaling the start of Yom Hazikaron of Memorial Day. And this morning at 11 o'clock, another siren brought the whole country to a standstill as we bowed our heads. Now today, what Israelis will do is we will really immerse ourselves in the, the mourning, in the remembrance process. We will tell and listen to the stories of those who we have lost, memorializing them, remembering them, remembering that unto every person who has fallen, there is a name, a family, a future that will never be. We will join together as communities in cemeteries and in places across the country to hold services of memorial. And then later today, the whole mood of the country is going to change as we approach Yom Ha'atzma'ut, which is Independence Day. Now, yesterday on, on air, on radio, I was asked by Simon a very interesting question. He said, how easy is it to make the flip from this very intense morning to one of extreme celebration. And I said to him, it's actually quite easy for us, and I'll tell you why. We spend a day really feeling those feelings, really remembering, really experiencing, and, and going through the process. And it, it's almost like a journey and a catharsis. It's, it's very, very good for the, our emotional well-being. And it's something that truly brings us together as, as a nation, whether you are religious or secular, Ashkenazi, Safadi, if you are Jew or Druze, whoever you are, we come together. And as the day gets on, so the mood lightens. And when that uh, hour strikes eight to night, which single, uh, uh, signals in Yom Ha'atzma'ot, the 71st uh, uh, Independence Day celebration, the feeling of celebration and of honoring all we have lost because we know the price that we have paid to have the country that we have today and we celebrate not just for us but for them and those who never could have a, a free state a state of Israel themselves so I'm Raleen Marks this is the Israel Brief I'm saying Chag Ha'atzma'ut Sameach as we approach Yom Ha'atzma'ut and don't forget you can check out our content online at www.layoftheland.online. Also, our Facebook community is growing, guys, and make sure you're a part of it. And join us at Lottle site, as well as clicking on the subscribe button below. And I'll join you tomorrow for a special Yom Ha'atzma'ut edition.